and welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some Iceborne Valor. That's right, we have another meme tier deck. This is going to be an Iceborne Legacy deck with Valor. We know that Quinn uh, creates Valor whenever uh, whenever it's summoned. You know, you get to summon a Valor. Also, Quinn's champion spell is this Blinding Assault that makes Valors. And so hopefully we can have a good amount of Valors in play. And our what our goal is to use this Iceborne Legacy on a Valor so that all Valors everywhere get plus two, plus two. So instead of being two ones, they are now four, three Scout Challengers. That's a big difference. And so we're gonna have, you know, Quinn with Blinding Assault, but then also our other way to make Valors is gonna be Swift Wing Flight. That we play it, we can create a Blinding Assault in hand. So we have, we have a few different ways to make some Valors with Iceborne Legacy. So we're gonna have the Valors be Scout. They'll be challenging. Um, a cool card that also works with Scout for a champion is Jarvan, because you Scout attack um, with whatever, and then, you know, like a Valor, and then Jarvan gets to come into play challenging right, th right there, and then we can still, like with our regular attack, attack with Jarvan again. We'll also have two copies of King Jarvan, because if we have Jarvan in play, then King Jarvan can give everything Challenger and Scout, which sounds pretty good for Quinn. Uh, Quinn likes... You know, everything else having Scout for more attacks and, of course, everything having Challenger and everything having Challenger works well with the Swift Wing Flight. So we have some different cool synergies in here. Also have some rallies with Golden Ages. They can work well with Blinding Assault. Bright Steel Protector can protect Valor or Ice Veil Archer can Frostbite the enemy the, that Valor is about to challenge. And then we also have good um, protection for Valor, whether Valor's challenging or you know, when we Iceborne Legacy, you know, we can have a Troll Chant, a Sharp Sight, a Ranger's Resolve to help protect and help that uh, Iceborne Legacy resolve. So that's the deck. Looks pretty cool. Quinn, Jarvan, Iceborne, Valor. Let's go play our five games over in Normal because it is a meme tier deck. And we'll see how it does. Hopefully we get to do some cool stuff with Iceborne Legacy and Valor. Okay, Trundle Aurelian Soul. That is a deck that probably doesn't care too much about small little two ones too much, to be honest. All right, but I'm going to keep a sharp sight to protect our Valor because we do want to attack multiple times. So this is going to be a Targon's Peak deck. So attacking multiple times can be beneficial. And so that's what the scouts can do. They can attack multiple times. Okay, just a pass. That thing's an O3? Huh. You learn something new every day. So we know they have one, at least one card that costs eight plus mana. They are really trying to ramp hard. We're to keep them from ramping. Wow, they just surrender. To the birds. Wow. How about that? Alright, so so far so good. We have played one game and Valor single-handedly won that game. <laughs> Which we are a Valor deck, so we can't ask for anything more. Um, again, another control deck not exactly what we want to face right like our deck with challengers and stuff we want to face other we want to face like small unit decks we don't want to face avalanche decks so we we're pretty fortunate that game they just had uh those uh, i don't know whatever you want to call them those units for us to challenge and kill but this one probably isn't going to have those kind of things that they'll probably have your avalanches and stuff like that and that's going to be kind of rough for us but we're gonna just Kind of play some stuff until then. 
If you're wondering why we have a Zier here, because Zier's a bird. Yeah, so we have our bird card back, bird, guardian. We got our birds. All right, we're gonna waste the two mana anyway. So. Let's go, Valor. Get Lissandra. Wow, Vengeance. Lissandra. Wow. Or, sorry, sorry. Vengeance, the Valors to keep their Lissandra alive. All right, so we can uh, do this and you know, we'll just make Blinding Assault. So we have two 3 2 challengers. Which doesn't actually kill Lissandra. Like, that's kind of the, the bad part here, is we don't actually kill Lissandra. Oh, well, I think I think I'm still going to do it. We get three damage in on them. Now if they play an Avalanche, their Lissandra dies to an Avalanche. Ooh, I like Ranger's Resolve. This is going to be fun. Do not embarrass me, troll. We're not done yet. I'll knock him down. Okay. I've got your back. The big question is if I'm playing my other blinding assault before attacking or not. You know, like, what am I doing with this other blinding assault? I think I am. Maybe I'll just do this. Yeah, they're playing TLC. Yeah, they're playing uh, Trundle Lissandra. Hey, KO. Yeah, we playing some Quinn today. Been a minute since we played Quinn. Alright, so I can keep the Valor alive with the Troll Chant. I think I'll just... Pass. We'll put him down to three. We're, we're still keeping up, like, good protection. Ooh, that could be kind of nice. Ugh. I wear the crown. And bear its burden. Still heart, steady aim. So I don't know if. Okay, cool. I was going to say, I don't know if they'll take the Jarvan that, we, that they know about or not, you know, now that we drew this new Jarvan. I'm glad they took the one that they knew about and put that in play. We're going to take out this 3-3. Level up Quinn. Do 2 damage to Trundle. And why not level up Jarvan in the process? I can play this other blinding assault, but I'm just gonna keep Troll Chant available. Cool, cool, cool. There we go. 
All right, Quinn and Valor getting some wins. Two and zero. Yeah, I think. Yeah, I think our opponent did have a poor hand there. But what's really good against like those avalanche decks is rallies and uh, scout attacks are basically rallies. You know, like attacking a lot because they don't like block a lot, right? Because they're using like the AOE damage, and so attacking a lot's very good against them. So we actually have a, a pretty solid strat against those style of decks. Uh, we'll send back the twos and the fives, but I guess I could see keeping a concerted strike to try to take down a, a Yasuo because a Yasuo could be. Uh, really good. But I didn't really want to keep Quinn and Concerned Strike and keep two uh, fives in hand. Think you're fast? Cute. You're covered. So very sad Bright Seal Protector. Getting Stun Moon Weapon. hurts because then they, they probably have stun we'd have to assume that they have stun moon weapon Honor guide me. or not stun moon one but yeah that kind of thing it's a stun card like that so they have sealed weapons yeah yeah he also is the one card that that can definitely kill us yeah i mean i guess we play troll chant to just keep the three two challenger alive i guess Man, that hurts. Just Here's our chance. Yeah, I love playing against Yasuo decks when they don't have Yasuo, but having Yasuo That's bad news. One blade, one purpose. Yeah, so we want to we want to drive the next round, yes, but that means that we don't really get to play Quinn. We're just pretty dead. We're just pretty dead. Okay. Well, none of these games were particularly close. <laughs> you know, we ran over our first two opponents, and this one just had Yasuo and all stuns, and that that's just game over there. So, yeah, good game, Yasuo. All right, two and one. This is why when people say Yasuo needs a buff, Yasuo does not need a buff. It's just the cards around Yasuo when you don't have Yasuo. Like, that's the problem. Not when it, the, the actual card Yasuo is incredible. Okay, Ezreal Vine. So again, you know, like a Shell Folk deck. I kind of wouldn't mind keeping Jarvan, to be honest. Like, this card's definitely gone, but I could see keeping the rest of these. Yeah, sure. Like, Jarvan's gonna be awesome. And being a Bandle City deck, they're going to play tons of these 2-2s, two these Manifest cards. So I'm thinking that Protégé can really help take those things down, especially with the help of Ranger's Resolve to stay alive. So the Swiftwing Flight can make a Blinding Assault, which can get us a Valor, which we can Iceborne Legacy the Valor. We have to make sure to try to have something to protect the Valor from Mystic Shot. This is a deck that will be playing like Mystic Shot and some fumes and things like that. Ooh, there's Blinding Us all right there. Tentacles off the 
Level up that Jarvan real quick. Let us take a peek at life beneath the waves. Yeah, those things are pretty nice. Are you out? Try. We may be able to get a 4 3 bird. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't, I don't think it will actually work. They're probably going to have Mystic Shot and stuff like that. And they didn't tap out. Like, they still have Mystic Shot, Sun Fumes, Get Excited, all those kind of cards. It's, it's highly unlikely that it works. If I. Otherwise, I could just play this other Blinding Assault and just, you know, have. be able to attack. Scout Attack, Jarvan, keep Sharp Sight available. I'll just pass. Okay, so I wasted two mana. Okay. I was kind of expecting a... Uh, Mini morph there. That's the name of the card. Let me get you that fire. Run <laughs> so that was the card that Archivist grabbed. Yeah, so the, the Iceborne Legacy definitely would not have worked. I think they'd be paying attention to the Sharvin, probably. Okay, we're gonna try. Cause yeah, it is it is meme tier Tuesday, so we're gonna try. Cause chat really wants me to make a try, but it's not a very yeah, <laughs> yeah, it was wasn't a good play at all. Like, you know, Cataclysm would be the better play, but oh well. We have to try. At least once to Iceborne Legacy, but you can tell that they have all this mana, like they're They're ready for it. Ours is but to do and die. Nothing gets between me and my mark. I think it's play Quinn. I think if they use remove, you know, like they're probably sitting here with again more removal. Like they killed the Jarvan, I want to draw a new Jarvan. I think that's probably going to be more valuable than the um, the other way that thing could go. So I do this. They kill the Jarvan in response. Then I have n only one mana left, but I'd still have the sharp sight. Ah, that's probably not worth it. Scouting ahead. Gotta survey the battlefield. It doesn't add up. So close. Okay. 
bumps them down to one. It's not bad. Man, this is rough. If they have double Mystic Shot in hand, this is really rough. Like, I don't really have any good options if they have double Mystic Shot in hand. Ooh! No removal spell right there. Wow, why didn't they Mystic Shot in response? Okay, that's perfectly fine with me. Why don't they just do it in response to the Cataclysm, and then it dies? And then one even got this challenge. How they timed that wrong? Down to only two cards left. All right, that'll do. That will do. Great. Three and one. Now let's get back out there. So we have. Pike in action. So probably going to be a good amount of predict. We'll keep one troll chant because, uh, you know, action is a champion that wants to be in combat all the time. Troll chant, good against that. And we can just pass here. They play action, I challenge. Uh, I don't, maybe, I don't even know if I challenge. Whoa, that's an odd time for Call the Pack, isn't it? Isn't that an old, odd time for Call the Pack? Break their spirits and their swords. Huh. It's been an odd game. Ice Veil Valor. Basically Iceborne Valor. Just Ice Veil Valor. So we're gonna have one of those champions that's gonna be bit it's gonna be larger. You ain't killing my Valor. My Valor too cool. That's right, Valor make him so render. Yeah, we had that one pretty well in hand. Get a free kill there, then we get attacked for seven, and we have full control of the board. We had Quinn, we had Golden Ages. That was game. Full control of the board. Our hand was really good. Uh, Quellen says you can get a lot of value out of Valor with freezes, and that's that's what we're kind of going with with that Ice Veil Archer. I wanted to play more Ice Veil Archers, but it was just really hard to find room because, you know, like all these cards are just so important. Um, so we just couldn't really find more room. So unfortunately, we didn't get to do the cool meme tier part of our deck with Iceborne Legacy and Valor. Iceborne Legacy is just really hard to pull off. It is, but our deck looked good. I liked just, if you just kind of look at the, the Quinn of Jarvan, like, I think those two champions honestly looked really good together. You know, now Quinn's a little bit bigger, being that 3-5. That was important uh, in some of those games. But then, you know, Scout Attack, put Jarvan into play, Scout Attack. That was nice. You know, King Jarvan making things Scout also, or just drawing more Jarvins. I liked that part of our deck. And then, you know, Swiftwing Flight, also awesome with Protégé, Blinding Assault. 
that kind of stuff. And then, you know, you get two of the best combat tricks with Sharp Sight Troll Chant. So I think there's a lot of good stuff to like here, even without the Iceborne Legacy. Um, you know, like we were trying that for the meme tier thing. But if you want to make it like a competitive ranked version of Quinn Jarvin, I think you could. I think, you know, if you remove these, maybe put in another Ice Fill Archer and... Uh, I don't know, you got you have a lot of options. <laughs> there are tons of good cards you can be playing, but um, you know, maybe even I'd probably just say get another Ice Hill Archer in here and maybe get I don't know, maybe like three sisters. Because like three sisters, you can do all sorts of cool stuff with that with Fury of the North, Flash Freeze, you know, you, you got a lot of good options there. You know, maybe a single combat, uh maybe something that has a little bit of card draw in it, like a babbling beard, you know, because we don't have very much card draw at all or, or a vanguard redeemer um something like that maybe even a vanguard sergeant making a four demacia for everything there are there are just so many options of cards that you can play in these kind of decks maybe just you know get your own cataclysm in here um you know that's an option also or just get that third ice field archer i don't know i think that you could probably um also obviously elixir of iron brittle steel those are both very good cards um you know, for different times also. So if you if you want, you can uh, certainly replace your three the three um, Iceborne Legacies and play just higher. Uh, I guess more consistent cards. There you go. Oh, not necessarily higher impact, but just more consistent cards. Um, and that's that's definitely an option um, if you want to just try Quinn Jarvin more in ranked. But uh, you never know. Maybe you can pull off the Iceborne Legacy valor combo so those y'all watching later on youtube hit that like button and let me know do you have you pulled off that iceborne legacy valor combo so how was it if you got other ideas for the iceborne legacies for a more competitive version let me know but i definitely was impressed with just challengers quinn jarvin and then having sharp side troll chant to go along with challengers that actually looked pretty good all right but that's going to be it for iceborne valor so thank you so much for watching and i'll see you for the next video